Hey guys, so I just watched the music video for Storm Corrosion's lead single, Drag Ropes. Um, if you don't know Storm Corrosion, um, they are a collaboration between uh, Opet's Mikhail Ockerfell and Porcupine Tree's Stephen Wilson, since they're, they've been best buddies since, you know, the Blackwater Park era. Like, the in absentia Blackwater Park era. That was when they basically became friends and started collaborating on each other's albums. And, uh, for a while they wanted to collaborate like on some brand new material that they couldn't do with either Opeth or Porcupine Tree so they decided to make Storm Corrosion in order to make this kind of music which I have to say um, hearing the lead single it sounds very like ambient for the most part it sounds very um, I guess it's more it's definitely proggy, but, I mean, it's not in the same sense of, like, Opeth, Porcupine Tree, proggy. They said it's, like, a long ways away from what they were doing with either Opeth and Porcupine Tree. But, yeah, I mean, this music features no drums at all. I don't remember even hearing drums, but it's much more ambient for the most part. But, um, this is still really good. I think this is a really awesome song. I mean, it has its moments of drag. But it's still a really engaging song, and I think everyone should check this out for sure. And this is actually the first time I've ever seen a music video around the length of 10 minutes, especially an animated one like this one. But yeah, this is definitely an animated music video. It looks like it was directed by Tim Burton, if you look at it. But, um... <clears throat> um so yeah, let me talk about the music video. I guess it tells a story of some sort. It tells a story of like two lovers who basically go into the woods to get married, but I guess there's like the spy who finds them. I guess he tells the priest that they're about to get married, and like this big giant hand just grabs the wife, just snatches her away. And obviously the husband's pretty sad. So I guess he asks for like a red potion at this one pharmacist's office. And, um, I guess he pours it on this one bag or something. As it turns out, he's gonna hang her. I forgot to mention in the beginning, it actually starts out with a lady being hung. And, um, I guess the process starts all over again because I guess the priest makes him hang his own wife. And as a result, at the very end of the music video, he just, like, traps the priest inside his own church and just burns him alive. <laughs> but... Yeah, it's a very strange, very surreal music video. Um, again, it looks like something Tim Burton would direct. And I wouldn't be surprised if Tim Burton went out of his way to direct this film, or music video. It's just a very surreal, very, very strange music video, but it's still... I liked it. I thought it was really good. Um, and yeah, again, the music is very ambient, very just out there. Um, at first it's more orchestral. In the first section it's about, it's kind of creepy and unsettling the music at first. I mean, it's orchestral at first, you hear Mikhail singing. It's actually a pretty creepy section. It kind of reminds me of like, and don't laugh, but the beginning and the end of Gary Wright's hit single, Dreamweaver. But, <laughs> yeah, the beginning and end of that song, not the chorus or anything like that, no, but like the beginning and the end of the song Dreamweaver, it haunts my nightmares, it really does. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's pretty unsettling, the introduction of the song, um, Drag Ropes this time. The introduction of Drag Ropes is pretty unsettling, and they actually reprise that introduction, but they do it in a more upbeat fashion, like they play it with the guitars and the bass and all that later on in the song. And, you know, at the part where they just burn the church alive, it becomes a bit more unsettling once again. And, um, yeah, in the middle, it's actually a bit more upbeat because you actually hear Stephen Wilson, like, you know, overdubbing his vocals a lot. And um, it works really well. And the sound of the Mellotron is, of course, divine. But uh, I think I'm rambling here. Definitely check out this music video. I'll send a link down below. Again, it's like something Tim Burton would direct, as I keep saying a million times, but it seriously is. It kind of reminds me of, like, the Corpse Bride or Coraline just fused together. 
definitely check it out. I'll send a link down below, and uh, thanks for watching.